Now, not all cities are as kind to their police departments and willing to back them. What I mean by that is New York kind of sucks. I mean, they did elect Andrew Cuomo, so that's not really much of a surprise, but why am I saying it sucks? Well, they apparently, because a lot of people, after the civil unrest that happened with, after the death of George Floyd, there are a lot of places, especially blue states, who are going to do, who are trying to do police reforms. And um, one of the places was uh, New York. How, why did I? Why did I? Why did my mind blank on that? That's weird. Anyway, um, New York. So they decided to do like a panel and try to come up with new ways to reform the police. Now. I know a lot of people were in favor of that, and a lot of people won't be, but let's, I think both sides can agree on this one thing. That the person that they got, one of the people that they got, was a cop killer. Apparently what happened was the cop killer, when he was 16, he and his, like, I think four other armed teenagers, they were robbing, like, a bar and grill, I think, something like that, and then... An off-duty uh, officer named was it Robert Walsh? I believe so. If not, I'll, it's up here, so you guys can probably know the name. Um, he was off-duty, but he did try to stop them, and for that he got shot. And it wasn't just a uh, shot, and then the kids ran away. The cop killer shot him. Like I don't remember where I don't know where if it was in the shoulder or something like that. And as he lay down helplessly, the cop killer then walked up to Walsh as he was lying down, like, because he was shot, and, like, laying down helplessly, put, pointed the gun to his head and shot him again. And now he's on a police reform panel. Naturally, people are angry, like, the cops, the police department isn't happy, the the Walsh's family is not happy about it. Now, apparently the cop killer was who was released from prison, I think in 2019, has been working with non-profit organizations to provide food and shelter for the homeless. That is good. I'm not knocking that. That is a good thing to do. I still don't think that he should be on a police reform panel. Now, apparently, this is part of a police reform initiative by our good old pal, who always keeps his hands to himself, Andrew Cuomo. I was going to say Governor Andrew Cuomo, but I don't think he's the governor anymore. From what I heard, he's resigned. But, I mean, it's not going to matter if New York literally just gets someone who's just like him in. New York, do better. But anyway, Andrew Cuomo said that to all local governments that they needed to come up with a police reform plan otherwise they wouldn't get federal funding and he was so serious with it he said period at the end and as we all know that is a very big sign of intelligence right there